Ooh, I got a juicy little text message there. <laughs> I don't want to know how juicy it is. I'm good. <laughs> sorry. Sorry, I had my moment. Um, this is Shay from Touche Podcast. And this is Shay. From and Touché. this is our special guest, King Zulu. King Zulu from the Motion Network. I am glad to be here. I appreciate the invite and the opportunity to be on a different platform. There you go. You're welcome. Yeah. Thank you very much. We do what we can. Uh huh. Yeah. So today I posted a question <laughs> on, <are> you <laughs> on Touche Podcast. Why well, look like you stuffed in, in the uh, camera? You yeah, can... because I'm the guest, I guess. <laughs> you can scoot over. So you look, need to. I posted a question on Touche Podcast's uh, Instagram page today. Nobody has answered it, so I Uh-oh. on camera once. Oh. Or Dishe and King Zulu to answer the question. Uh-huh. Here we go. Here we go. So it says, I have six eggs. I broke two, I fried two, and I eat two. How many were left? Dishe said, Hold on, hold on. Now it's four. It's four now. It's four. I take, I take it she back. She said four. six at first. I did she say- said, no, she said they were all gone at first. All right, I, got, I say four now. So you had six eggs. You broke two. You fried two, and you ate two. Yes. So that means you have four left. Okay. That's if true. one train leaves. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. However, in the other instance, though. You could do all of them. Exactly. Mm-hmm. You can do huh? all of them, but it's. How, how can you do the ones that's broken? Because you can break two, leave them alone. Right, and then fry, fry two. two of them. Like, like, and break, then, like and you can boil two and eat them. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, like break them and, like, have them open to where I'm ready to eat them? No, break them like they fell. Yeah. That should have been falling then. That should not have been but they, broken. They, they, because how other, otherwise, how can you break an egg? You have to break it. Yeah. So, technically... Nigga, you got it's four a total eggs of left. six eggs. You got four eggs. When left. you think about it's it, it's subjective. Now. It's very subjective, you, but you could do, you can do of, all of because them. Because of anything, they if should you, have said, I had two that fell. I had they two that fell. They won't say that because they want you to think. They want you to use your mind and think. But otherwise, how do you open eggs? You break them. Nigga. You Thank you. you I, I feel like y'all all on my side no. on this one. Come on, bring it in. Bring it in. You yes. You want us all to be on your side. Right. That's you just not the case. them. Crack and break the same thing. Them. Yeah. Really? Mm. Okay. So That's crazy. we're bringing we're bringing a new episode to you guys on this lovely Saturday evening. I like that whole space. Thought that was my favorite. Um, just impromptu shit. You see, we got our drinks mm. going here. We got I don't something have any here. You got something there. And I don't have any drinks. I drank my something there. Can you see the drink? That yeah, I have? You it's can't. there. Um, I definitely can't so see my drink. We, where I work is on my drink. Oh, no, no, yes, it is. If you turn it that other way. No, it's both ways. No, I mean, it's both ways. Yeah. E- just, just even, even touch damn but cup we, no more. Just know that we're, we're drinking. drinking at their house. Yeah. We're home. You're home. You're not we're, out and about. We're, not, the we're not, not drinking and driving. We're not working machinery. It's, it's me, face. You <laughs> <laughs> saying my name on <laughs> So we decided to bring an impromptu episode um, with everything uh, going on in the politics the, uh, and all that good license stuff. License brewery. Come on, nigga. We doing all sorry. this shit for two punk ass quarters. All this motherfucking. <laughs> <laughs> it is squirrel Woo. moment. Right. Y'all Squirt. equally having a squirrel moment. <laughs> and I'm re-recording. Oh, You're yeah. re-re? No. A oh, re re <laughs> okay, what's next? So, King Zulu, uh, summarize for everybody who did not catch what you posted on Motion about the whole network impeachment. Impeach- Absolutely, just Lush- quickly Lush- in fifty words or less. Well, here, no, I don't have, you know, I don't have a word counter on me, but in short, so the impeachment of Donald Trump is real. It's happening. No, ironic it, your shirt that you have on while you're speaking about politics uh-huh. is really great. You know, yeah, yeah, so the shirt is the 20 it's the 20th anniversary of the Million Man March. So back in 2015 in October actually, which is coming up, which 11. it'll be the 24th anniversary of it anyway. Mm-hmm. But we went to Washington, D.C. That was D. dope, too. Me and you went to Washington, D.C. That was dope, though. I did not go, because niggas don't be inviting people, but we, that's okay. We were particip- we participated in the Million Man March, the 20th dope. anniversary. I got this shirt from D.C. We got another shirt. It says something got to change in yes. the uh, Straight Outta Compton kind of platform. Mm-hmm. 
really dope, really dope experience. It was a lot of people. It was a lot of. Uh, it, it was actually around the time the African American History Museum was in DC was being built. Yeah, we thought and it was something we else. Need to, yeah, we need to go back and actually visit that. But yeah. <clears throat> <laughs> to summarize, if you hear that, that's our dog uh, whistling or whining. No, that was the police, my man. That I don't was, think it that was. That was the police. That sounded like Knox. That was dog. But, um, that was Knox whistling. So to summarize the impeachment. His so what happens? Business. What happened was Sorry. there was uh, a foreign uh, exchange kind of conspiracy between the president of the United States, yours truly, Mr. Donald Trump, and the Ukrainian leader, the Ukrainian president, I can't pronounce his name, I don't, you know, I'm not even going to try, and basically what it was, was the Ukraine and Russia is going into a debacle right now, and they're, they're at war right now, and basically the Ukraine is asking for United States help, so... In order, Trump is saying that in order for the United States to help, then they need to investigate presidential candidate Joe Biden. And why? Joe what? Joe Biden. Mm. This nigga said Joe Biden. <laughs> Joe, he could be a candidate. Too. Joe Biden, the former vice president of the United States. So, and his son. His son is the, the one that passed away. Not the one that passed away. No, that that's John Edwards, who you're thinking about. Mm. 2008 candidate, but yeah, no, I'm talking know, about Joe Biden's son. One of his sons, Joe Biden. That was Joe Edwards. No, Biden's son, John Edwards. I don't know. I like Whatever. Go ahead. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> Joe Biden's son is a uh, uh, very an employee rude. of a Ukrainian uh, corporation based out of the United States. Then that's you know. So basically, Donald Trump, yeah, it's a lot because the initial report, the initial accusation was that uh, Donald Trump was holding, withholding money and withholding military aid from the Sounds Ukrainian right. government in, in worth of about $250 million. Mm. So basically, he hanging this money over this dude's head and say, hey, look, I'll give you this money if you investigate Joe Biden and his son. To get him up out of the race so that I have a better chance of winning the presidency in 2020. Oh, now, yikes. when you're the president of the United States, you cannot have these kind of conversations with foreign leaders and with any other country because now they interfere and intercede in our internal affairs. And that that's just, that's just a matter so of national security. So now they in our business. Exactly. That's just a matter of national security. Nobody really wants that. So, finally, the House of Representatives finally felt that it was time for him to get the fuck up out of here. I agree. It's been a long time coming. So, you know, yeah. so. let's get I'm his ass wa- on out. Pack I'm more so let's go. waiting for action. Give me the action. I'm, I wish this would have happened a lot sooner, but, you know. Well, here. Is this, good- is this whole recording going to be about him? No, no, we just wanted no. Junie to summarize. The good news, the good news I don't about be it. Sad this whole time. You're not gonna be sad because the good news about it is the what you can kind of look forward to is Donald Trump never being the president ever again. Because you know he he's like going on the road team. now talking about he's campaigning right yeah. now and he's the incumbent president, so he has the automatic nomination to be the Republican front runner for the presidency in 2020. With him going under impeachment. Which this normally it takes two or three months, but the Senate has already got the Senate has already got the votes for impeachment, so they he goes to trial for impeachment pretty soon. So yes. if they find him guilty of all these charges and they truly impeach him, he cannot run. I'm cool in with 2020. That. I'm okay with that. So now we have a chance to get somebody else in there, whether it be Republican or these Democrats that I've been talking about. Make sure you tune in. I've been talking about these Democratic nominees and they've got some good views about how this country should be ran. On what channel? It's on the Motion Network on YouTube. What days are politics discussed? Politics are discussed on Wednesdays. So Wednesday evenings around 6 o'clock, you'll be able to find out everything like you need to know channel. about uh, politics. Straight from me. And if I've summarized it well enough for you, make sure you tune in and make sure you tune in to this podcast too because they're very informative about we do what we can. Um, Every other Wednesday. Every other Wednesday. <clears throat> yeah. 
about everything. So, yeah. again, appreciate it, guys. No problem. Yeah. Thanks for uh, stopping by on our channel. Absolutely. To let our viewers know what's well, going on in politics house, because so I don't really right. fuck around, but to, well, to hear it, it broken down on a level that I can understand. And that's the thing. A lot of people don't, and, that, and that's, that's the cool thing about what I, I guess, do. Bring. Yeah, because like a lot of people aren't interested in it. And yeah, because I'm not. But as soon as you I think do more, it, I'm more, like, think, okay. What but I, I think what more I'm and more listening. people want to be interested in it because so many people want to see Donald Trump out of office. Right. So yeah, more young exactly. people are getting into politics because yeah, they exactly. like, uh, I don't know how to hold a conversation. Well, I guess that's just me. I don't know how to hold a conversation regarding politics because I don't I just keep my opinion to myself, but I want to know what's going on. I don't I follow I a lot of it. I just, I see, you know, shit on social media. I see shit on CNN and and. Fox 2 News and so like that. And I'm like, this guy is a fucking disgrace. Well, so I followed it enough to be ashamed to say that Donald Trump is the president of the United States. Yeah. And I think about it as, um, you know, back in the day. Back in the day when I was young, I'm not a kid anymore. Sorry. Sorry. She had a moment. Uh, the Greek philosopher Plato. Okay. Has a, has an analogy of politics and how the, how civilization shall be run. Mm. And he, and he compared it to like how a ship is run. Like you have a captain, and then you have your shipmates, and then you have everybody. So everybody picks a captain. You know, we know where we want to go. We know our end destination, but we need somebody to actually guide this ship mm-hmm. and actually, mm-hmm. you know, what I'm saying, get us to where we need to go because we don't actually have the courage, or the knowledge, or just the wherewithal to just actually lead this ship to where we need to go so that's how democracy works you know and a lot of people we want to vote on who's charismatic on who knows their stuff and who is really in our best interest and you know honestly donald trump wasn't that for a lot of people but the I majority think, of people I think he was who, more so of an But escape. honestly, I think that we we probably really didn't have two really good candidates anyway. There was something wrong true. with Hillary. There was something That's wrong true. with Donald That's Trump. True. So we really didn't have... But isn't it always some something wrong people. with somebody? It's but always something exactly. wrong. Exactly. So when you, when you think about it, <clears throat> when you think back to the 2008 election, and in the 2008 campaign, you had Barack Obama, you had uh, John McCain. Um, you, did you want an older guy older Republican white male to run the country because he has the experience. He was a senator from Arizona for, you know, for a hundred, not hundreds of years. He was, he, Forever. He, he was, yeah, he had the experience. But on the other hand, Barack Obama, he had the energy and he was different because he was African American. He wants somebody that has energy. Have but he, but on the other hand, he didn't he have the experience. To hear a lot of stuff. So yeah. people believed in hope at that time. Between those two candidates, you talking about the last election with Hillary and Donald Trump, no one felt like they had hope with either candidate. So they, either a lot way, of people felt way, like I was, I was ambushed. A lot of people felt like, well, shit, I'm just not gonna vote. Right, and that so made it even worse. It made it even worse because, vote. yeah, yeah, because. In all actuality, when people, I can go on and on about this right. thing, but we don't really want this whole this, episode. Yeah, it's a lot. To Make be sure you politics. tune in Wednesdays on YouTube to the Motion Network, Moment of Truth Network. Everything you need to know about politics, if you if you're interested in it, we'll, we'll give Even you. Even if you are, and you right. want to get more got, into you guys got other stuff going on. Oh, absolutely. We got us, we got sports, we got art, we got fitness, we got just entertainment news. We've got it all. So. And this Make is sure one of out. the podcasts that we shared on our very first episode um, when we were shouting out a bunch of local excellence. So I never said s- network on. Never so I never, I never stamped it. Pretty sure but they, it's Motion they, Network. Mm-hmm. But these are all St. Louis-based um, organizations that we, we shout out on our podcast. So um, we try to give you guys as much, as much information as possible so that you can find them and follow them, tune in. The last episode that we posted, Dishe gave um, the guy who had the farm. Yep. For yeah. the culture, too. For the culture. Yep. yep. So we try to, I mean, we will shout out, you know, people that are not necessarily in St. Louis, but they got, they're local and they got things going on there for those two people in St. Louis. No, I'm saying we will shout out people that oh, are not yeah. necessarily here, but they're locally and they're, well, local in their community and they're trying to mm-hmm. do something. So just send that information to touche podcast at gmail.com if you want your your information shared. Um, 
it's free you know we, we ain't doing it we ain't trying to get paid to just promote you we just want to promote you yeah. and, and hope let that. people know who you are and what you do yeah. if you for the community we all down for it i was getting ready to go like this Ooh, that's my drink i see hey you need a refill need a refill you know what you know what i was so pissed off that y'all didn't know what the fuck that was i'm sure i i i, I put my dj ear on i was like i know this verse where is I'm it like, you know, it was like, I, I looked at my phone i was like I feel like the girl at the bar that's been there too long. I'm like, well, get the fuck up out of there. Like, niggas. <laughs> niggas. I'm, like, sitting, I'm I clearly at I work. I, I, was like, <laughs> I was on my way back from the bathroom from work, and I was like, I know this verse. Where is it from? And I, but put, I, was, I, was I even thinking, put the music notes in front I, of it. I know it was from a verse, but I was like, I was thinking from uh, Old Girl Roller Coaster. Oh, um... Emotional roller coaster. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. it's I'm about to say Al Green, but that's that a, ain't even, that's a But I've never Al heard Green. of anything else from El Varner but that song. Is El it? El Varner has. She got another song. She got another song out that I got on my phone. Oh. So while we doing our impromptu uh, meeting, is there anything fun and interesting you guys want to share and discuss? Yes. Go. I have a spacey thought. Oh, DJ always got spaces. Oh, let's hear it. Thank you. So, you know, how, you know how people, like, celebrate summer? Mm-mm. N- no? You know what I mean? Who celebrates summer? It's, it happens every year. <laughs> it's not more so of a celebration, but people be like, oh, Having it's a, a like, end of summer party. It's a, it's a, uh, it's a, um, a summer sale or... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, what is autumn? I don't fall. Know. It's a fall sale. Okay, okay. Let, let's, bring, let's bring it in. Let's bring it in. All right. But I don't think black people c- celebrate autumn. I think they're more so. No, for black fall. people don't call it autumn. They call it fall. I'm I'm here for fall. I'm I'm it's ready. I'm thing. ready for my hoodie season. I'm so not ready for this shit. I'm, like, I'm I was cool that today was like hot. I'm not ready to be because hoodie season just remind me that in a minute I've got to get a coat on. I don't want to wear a coat yeah. and have well, a free since, my car. Since so I'm from up. St. Louis, my throat all all we bit. do is wear two right. jackets and we got a coat. Yo, Thoke. My Thoke was hurting a little bit. See, I hate this. And then it's like more <laughs> medicine. <laughs> more medicine that you got to take when it get cold outside. Eyes itching and shit. So, then, so, and then I got to go get a fucking flu shot Tuesday. Like You got to get a flu shot. You got I, get, I get my flu you shot got, every year. You got that two give, persons. That gives you the flu, you know that? No, it don't. Here you go. Here you go. Here, here you it go. don't. That went past my question. That, Sorry, no. you little squirrely. I get the flu shot. When I get the flu shot. You know, I, you, 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 you have a me. weakened immune system. That's probably no, why you get the flu. He hasn't had the flu shot in a minute. Yeah, because every time I get the flu shot, when I was in the Army, I had to get the flu shot. So when I got the flu shot, every time I was sicker than a dog. You was getting, I, but you was getting ready to be sick anyway. That's all it means. Fuck all that shit. I'd rather get, take my chances in getting sick than give me the sickness. Nah. This nigga said, be, give me the sickness? What the fuck is that? Jacking in your arm? The flu. <laughs> well, they have to put a lot. Listen, this, look, this here's a, here's a, no, this no, no, no. Let me tell y'all what they do. Let me tell y'all what <laughs> they do. Flu, flu. They <laughs> shoot the live virus in your body. <laughs> So your body can fight it off. Your body is supposed to fight it off. If your body's not fighting the flu off, then your immune system is weakened. So then that wasn't my question. So then if if I don't get the flu shot and I get the flu, why I can't fight it off then? Because you have a weakened immune system. That so wasn't if I my have question, a weakened guys. immune system, why the fuck am I getting the shot? You ain't getting it because you just said you ain't had it in so long. You don't but get you're the not shot. answering my question. I'm that's not a physician. Maybe that's next why time. I get it. Next time, guys, that's we'll get a physician get on the episode. It. That way they can discuss how that's the flu shot That's why I don't work. get it. Because you're going to give me the shit. Oh, hope, hopefully he fight this shit off. Hell no. <laughs> I'm getting my flu don't shot give me this shit. I don't play that shit. My daughter get her flu shot next week. I don't play that shit. We ain't nobody taking off work or school in my house. Everybody going somewhere. Everybody. Everybody. If I gotta go to work every motherfucking day, you got to go to school every motherfucking day. All right, Joe Clark. You ain't at work today. Right. Not on Saturdays. You said every day, ma'am. 
Minus the you weekend. You really said er, so that's like er, every day right. in between right. days. Minus now, the weekend. Now, if you li- Can we bring it back to my question? Sick, and you get vaccinated, okay. you have to get vaccinations for your job or something. I really endorse that. Because mercy definitely make you get uh, vaccinated. However, Especially if the vaccination is free from your job. My, my vaccination, my job free. Or like if you're it's, opening packages from someone it's, else's house. It's a house. money plot. Why would, why, would you, why would you literally inject people just so they can try to fight it off? If they can't fight, why why won't you inject people with shit they can fight it off with? How do they know if you can fight it off? They don't inject exactly. You with a whole, so why would you? They don't inject you with a whole virus. It's like a portion of dead cells discussion. and then a portion of live cells. They don't cells. inject you with the whole virus. I don't know how they put the mixture wow. together, but they it's like they pre planned it. So my question is about okay. Let's get back to our question shot. in autumn and shit. All I'm saying is when I think of autumn, I think of flu shots, I think medicine, of my and coats. <laughs> you know what you got? And it's dark at four o'clock. What the it fuck? It showed the fuck is, and I hate that shit. The you fuck guys is that? really spoiled my Sorry. spacey my thoughts. My throat baby. hurt. It's part of spacey thoughts. All we this doing shit it. spacey. Yeah. My throat. And it's. <laughs> With your, your throat with cake. I'm going to run down my throat. <laughs> you had a. Did you break the ice? <laughs> yeah, because I almost died. She, her she shit on her. her yuck. A yuck. A yuck. A yuck. Turning to goofy and shit. Shit, that that's why I missed like. the Disney World. I ain't really, we, I ain't really uh, kidding. Yeah, 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 yeah. Damn, damn, damn. We goofy. gotta. I was talking to a friend today. At goofy, the, at if you the watching this? Room. Uh-uh. Hit me up. We gotta go to. She <laughs> told me we need to go to Disney. We gotta go and her yuck some bitches. Right? I don't wanna go because go her dude land. was fighting in. We ain't got to see him. That's hella funny. He was That's not funny. Yo, he was knocking he everybody out. He even knocked like, mama down, y'all. I don't think he knocked he mama down. Mama, just, mama got knocked down, down by some girl. girl. She just fell. She said, right, I thought she just fell. She said, huh? She thought that <laughs> no, was she gonna, did. She thought that was gonna make her son calm the fuck down. You got my mama. That right. No, that, that, that right. You knocked my mama out, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, damn. Yes. It took security hella to get because there. I don't they was think. watching Hold it on pause, the cameras. Pause. If you haven't seen the video, you seen watch it. Watch it. You yeah. seen it. You, I'm sure you seen it. I'm security. not getting really it. This Shit. was it Disney World. It was Disneyland in California. Disneyland in California. <laughs> yeah. Security was looking at this shit on the camera. Like, look at these niggas. Look, 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 look. <laughs> wow. Oh. You gonna They're go, like, Charlie? Not nah. going out there like that. Charlie, you gonna go? No. Nah. That nigga swung on nah, his nah, sister, nah, his nah, mama. Look, say, Frank, say nah, Ron. Nah, Frank was like, I'll go. Right. I'm tired of these niggas here. That's the new guy. They don't want that nigga out there nowhere. Say, seeing Frank. <laughs> look, 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 look. He, he finna go. Look, 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 look. Bow. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> now, and but, then what, what pissed me off is that when they tried to investigate it, because you know. Investigate? They, yeah, they was trying to investigate it. <laughs> And nobody, like nobody in the family, Why? wanted to tell their side of the story. They was like, we don't know yeah. what happened. But what? We don't know what happened. But how did nigga, you clearly know what the fuck happened? You were involved. But how did it get started? I don't know. Mm-hmm. I heard a couple things. I don't. I I don't think that they're truth. But somebody I seen. So said, who gonna, who gonna fill the tank up on the way back? Nigga, you. <laughs> I fill the tank up on the way here. And now fuck that. That's somebody said started. that his. Niggas fight over a tank of gas. And his sister came there to confront him in front of his wife. First of all, y'all yeah, went through I the whole like, thing part. I don't know. The whole thing part. How did you find them? Huh? Because Disneyland is big as fuck. First of all, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. How do you find them? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Were these people from California? I don't know. Probably not. Probably, I don't know. Who knows? They look like they was from Georgia. Well, damn, you just, damn. you just. Niggas in Georgia fight. Yeah, I guess yeah. like he did look but like they, you know, trying to say that niggas in Georgia beat their fucking girlfriends and knock their sisters they and shit out too. <laughs> shit, that could be anywhere. They probably do. I don't know where that was from. All I know is when know. they said the police was trying to contact them to get their side so they can investigate, and everybody in the family was like, everybody who was there was like, no. We were reading text messages. Oh! Like, Y'all going to strip club? Let's go. Hey, shake it, going. shake it, shake it, shake it. The movie shake Hustlers. Uh, uh, yeah. I do you not know want to call me. I don't want to call me. No, not Hey, like Kiki. No, don't hate me. What's up, Keeks? Keeks. Keeks? I hope you see this, Keeks. I've been down with you forever. You already know. You already know what it is, baby. No, <laughs> please block him, Kiki Palmer. The light skin face ain't gonna, gonna do it. Gonna light skin face. <coughs> this nigga said the light skin face. You look like your lips is extra crusty. Oh, you are. You look like you got lotion in your hair. 
It is. You look like you got lotion in your eyes. It is. Matter of fact, you know, baby oil in his eyes. Do they, you know, do they still make baby oil? I'm pretty sure they do. You can find it at Hustlers. But do people still put baby oil on the this- baby? <laughs> <laughs> Do they still put baby oil on babies? If you want to. Yeah, nah. I don't I didn't put baby that's, oil on my face. That's strictly for sex now. It seems to be. Shit. <laughs> so is it the bo- is it baby the Baby bo- oil only sold at Hustlers. Look, is it, is it, is it, is it <laughs> Johnson and Johnson got a whole Johnson, line? Johnson got <laughs> Hustlers is it baby is it the baby oil with the with the tap with the uh the cap broken off? Uh, the cap ain't broke off no more. This shit just open. That's now. nasty. That's what I'm saying, like the cap broken off. You pour, just throw it. So let me tell y'all. Ass. Let me tell y'all. Oh. About, okay, look, we getting we diverting. We got Pop. five minutes. So a friend of mine last night sent me. Just laugh like that. What was that? What the fuck was that? That was party Knox. Come on, keep it going. He ain't laughing. Oh, Knox. Hey, it couldn't be Knox. Come on. Okay, so a friend of mine last night Knox. sent me this sucker. Y'all some gonna, sucker MCs. Come I'm on. Come on. Mama Listen, mama. I'm trying to oh, tell y'all. We got squirrel. We getting squirrely. I'm going to my mama. House. We're gonna name this episode. Multiple squirrel moments. moments. I'm going to my mama house. No, you ain't, because she's going to kick your ass right back out. No, she not. She's going to talk to you. I'm going to call her now. Miss Andrew, like, don't open the door for him. Just the door unlocked. No, it ain't. It always unlocked. I'm going to have uh, Bob lock it. What's <laughs> the question from? Okay, so my sure. spacey thought is, so a friend of mine last mm-hmm. night sent me a picture. He was at his. A dick pic? No. Oh, okay. you talking he about, was at his. You talking about Ralph? No, just listen. Quit trying to guess who it is. Names, Ralph. No. So he Ralph sent, said he sent me a picture okay, last night. He was names. at his grandmother's house, and oh, he was trying to get God. he was trying to get a bottle of water, and she said it was in a drawer. So he reached bottle of water. Nigga, oh my God! This is why I don't tell stories. He had no credit card. Oh my God! <laughs> he had no credit card. You you was a fool. <laughs> I hate fool for y'all. <laughs> Can, can, I just, can I just get it card? off? I mean, can I get it out? Whoa, the motherfucker had a credit card. You so, can get anyway. it off if you want to, girl. <laughs> you was a fool if he had no credit card. So, look, he said he reached in the drawer and was like, I don't see no water. She's like, oh, it's in the back. So, he reached back there and found a dildo. A dildo. That's gay as shit. His grandma went? Yes! So, what would you do? Uh, and first of all, first of all, watch it out. my grandmama up. <laughs> Why she got water? Right why would you think you take a picture of it? That was why I was concerned. Why did you take a picture of it? Mm-mm. I'm dead. Nobody outside that household is supposed to see that. Oh my god, I was crying. Why she got water right where she got? I don't dildos. know. Why? Why is that? Not that's not even a question. So. I- <laughs> did she look angry? <laughs> so, I'm super so she can grab the water bar and be like. That's nasty. With the no, bo- I thought that was. Nasty. I thought that was. <laughs> The bottle uh baby oil was full. Not everybody has she ain't baby got oil. No spit. But don't baby oil dry you out? I don't know, nigga. I wasn't the main factor of baby no oil. Hmm? So what would y'all do? You. Whoa. If I found I wouldn't my ask my hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. And you touch I it. wouldn't ask my grandma for no water. I can find my water, my own. Self. First she ain't off, got no water. I just assume she ain't got He no was water. looking for bottled water. He Drink, drinks bottled there's no, water. If it's in the drawer, I don't want it. Her deal. Uh, why is the water in the, in the drawer? Huh? Her deal though in the fridge, then. No, no, it's in the it's drawer. In a, drawer. a drawer of what? Water. It's just a drawer that like a drawer <laughs> next to her. A drawer of what? <laughs> he confused. He got extra questions. Like no, just the question as it is. My what drink, would you do if you found a dildo at your grandmother's house? Water. Go. Was always in the fridge of dare, like she told me, <laughs> or on the floor. If it wasn't in the fridge, it was on the floor. Okay, but this, this, this parent, well, this time, Don't it was go in, the in my room, in my drawers, looking for shit. Okay, let's say it wasn't even water. Let's say she she sent you to her room to find something, and that's it's what, in a drawer. But that's and then you reach your hand in there, and you see it's a big ass dick. Don't go in my room looking for. But shit. But she told you to go in there. I ain't never told you no shit like that. <laughs> let's say your grandma did tell you to go in there and look for something. My grandma ain't never told me God rest Well, let's say you walked right in her house. <laughs> she God rest her soul. <laughs> she ain't never told me to go in there. She'll tell me go in there and lay your ass down. <laughs> when Car- you laid your ass, ass down and it was a dick right there. Carry your ass to bed. <laughs> no. Which one of your funky ass aunties told you? <laughs> <laughs> Which one of your funk ass ATs got a dick in? Yeah, yeah, hey, Sandra. Uh, Linda. That's Donna. Came on my nose. Oh my God. 
see, they got one of their ass to, to blame for that. They was like, huh? Now, I told I, I don't know what you. I would do if I found a dick in my grandma's house. I'm she like, wait. Not, 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 <laughs> not to put no dick now. Deal dog in my bed. <laughs> she winking and shit. No, what's wrong with y'all? Sandra, shut up. <laughs> I don't know what I would do if I found a dick in my grandma's house. I'd be ready to go. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go right now. Because fuck that. Well, my dad used to have. We said grandma. No, this is this is close enough here. So I used to go in my parents' room. No, I don't want to hear That's the problem here. right there. Stop it right there. I don't, don't right want to hear. I don't hear. I was, no, I was no. looking for money. Come on. Check this out. I don't want to know them. No. So I would find like these little, uh, these little bitty rubber things, and I thought they were condoms. Oh, okay. I thought they was too. I thought they were condoms. But they were like little finger things. Finger condoms, so when she's sewing? So that when like she's going through paperwork. Oh, the little rubber fingers. No, you can't. I know what you're talking about that. Little condoms. I thought she was. Ooh, Don't I thought that she was talking about something else. They may. You're okay. talking about the rubber finger with the little knife? Trojan, on them. here's some.